What's going on everyone? Today it's Nick Daniels and today we're at George's Island. say probably like an hour or so it took. We're just walking around waiting for the ferry in these fucking tight ass hallways, man. Like literally, <laughs> like, these are fucking small. Um, and then we'll, we'll do the rest of the vlog about how it was and stuff. Um, after I get off the island here, I'll continue the video along and we'll have a little chit chat about that. But so far we're just gonna walk around here and hopefully you're not claustrophobic, so yeah. All right, what's going on, everybody? We finished George's Island. We're back at the home. We're going to do a quick recap of the island, the tour, all that shit, um, and then we'll send you on your way. So, again, I'll be playing some footage as I speak just to kind of overlay what was going on, maybe a picture or two. Um, so the tour itself didn't take me that long. Uh, I'd say like an hour, to be quite honest. Like, and that was the whole thing. That's the entire island, everything you're allowed to do, uh, which was pretty good. I mean, the length, like, it, it's all, it's self-guided except for one part, which we'll talk about. Um, but the tour itself, like, you can't go in a lot of buildings. Um, so a lot of them are all sealed off and shit. So that's kind of also upsetting, too. Um, a big part of that for me is I always like looking in those. I like uh, going in. Also, here's the lake inside the apartment. Good time. Um, yeah, so I was, like, getting in that stuff. And it's just kind of a shame you can't. Um, the view of Halifax is, is fantastic. Um, I did get some, I got some fucking nice pictures there where uh, you're on the boat and you're, like, you're driving out, obviously, into the harbor. And it's just some good, good, if you're, like, into the photography, it's some fucking good shots, man. Um, and if not, it just looks fucking cool. Let's just chuck a rock in the water just to say I did. Check this out. Ready? Let's see. All right. That was fun. Yeah, so that was really cool. Um, I, I, I enjoyed that part of it. Um, the main the main focus of the entire tour, well, I mean, in my opinion, there's there's three parts that I really was like, oh, okay, this is actually kind of cool, um, is there's a lighthouse on there, which obviously I wanted to go get a better look at. You can't, like, go down the side of the hill to it, but, like, you're, like, right beside it. And again, I got, I thought, a couple half-decent pictures of it. Um, there's the fort uh, that's on there which is obviously the big deal. So you get to go in there, you can see all the cannon look-offs and stuff. The real thing to me though, was this tunnel system they had. Um, and it goes all throughout the island randomly. And there's like, there's obviously certain reasons and rooms for different things. Um, and the tunnels, in my opinion, were the best part, my favorite part of the entire island, uh, because you get to walk around and you really get to see what's going on. Um, and from McNabb's Island, which is the island across from it, uh, which I also did a video on, you can look from that island over and see the cannons poking out like the holes that they would have poked out at and guarded over the harbor with, which was really cool and I don't think was mentioned at all. Um, the only real complaint, like I said, I'd really have, there are a couple little complaints. Um, the price was fair, like it was 25, but like the fact that you can't go in like 99% of the buildings, um, like literally, like I was like, dude, like that, that kind of sucks. Like everything is sealed right up. Like I'm obviously for like kind of security reasons and stuff. Uh, but still it's like, oh man, it's just that, that's kind of upsetting. Like you can't get in a lot of those. And like my curiosity is like, I want to get in, I want to look at this shit and I can't. Um, so that was a big one. Um, the second one is the tunnels. You have to be into a tour to do it. Um, I go by myself. Like I, I'm on the island by myself, on the ferry by myself and everything. And uh, I'm walking around the island and like I go up to the tunnel and there was like a waiting line due to COVID, I guess. Um, and I didn't really know that I had to be in a tour. No one told me. So I just walked up and then they're like, oh, like a lady, like they were already walking inside and a lady was just like, oh, you can join them. And I was like, okay, cool. And I just walked in, but I didn't like join them. I thought I was just going to follow them along and they were going to do their thing. And, and I walked, like, I was walking down the hallways and stuff, and I was, like, really fucking cool, man, like, in the tunnels. Um, and obviously, I knew to follow them. Like, I wasn't like, oh, I'm going to just not do that. Um, and then the guy, like, it was just this young guy giving the tour. And he, uh, it is also really windy, by the way, so I hope the windbreaker's really getting its use today. Um, yeah, so this guy follows me over, this young guy. He comes out, 
like I, I walked past their tour and I heard him like stop talking and run right after me. And he was just like, basically like, what are you doing out here? And I was like, well, I'm taking photos or whatever. And he's like, well, you have to be in a tour. I was like, well, I, I wasn't told that. You know, I thought I, I was allowed to do it by myself. They didn't say anything. Like they didn't, they didn't say that. And he was like, what? That's not how it goes. Like you have to be in a tour. You're going to, you're going to have to leave. And I was like, all right, I guess I'll join the fucking tour. And he's like, that's awesome. Like, and he just felt like he loved it. Like that I joined the tour. So I literally like, there was like, what it was a family and a couple. Like a, like a girl and a guy together and then me. And I would just stand in the back behind everyone and just like not listen. I was like, listen, like, uh, I know, I know, I know like this is a vlog. This is supposed to be like all super positive. I was like, no man, like you're getting the real, you're still getting me. This is, you're just getting my thoughts on. It's just a rant in itself, right? All it is, is me just standing there and it's like, it's just like, dude, it's like, it's literally like a 16 year old kid just reading off a script. And I was like, man, like I, I just, I just wanted to look at this and it looks really cool and take some pictures and take my time. And like, I can't do that. Cause now like I can't take the pictures cause they're moving the tour and he'd be like, oh, is everybody here? And like, I'd be the one always way back, like just doing my thing. Cause that's, that's what I do. <laughs> um, but I don't know, man. So uh, kind of, kind of really annoying, honestly. And I didn't really like dealing with that. Um, and we get out of the tour and like, we get, like, I've already seen it all at that point. I've seen the entire island and buddy's just like, well, you know, like, thanks everybody. And I just left. I, w I just walked right through everybody and I'm like, I'm done. I did not want to be in the tour. No offense to the guy, but like I was told this was all self-guided and that's what I was under the impression of. And I just didn't really want to do a tour. I just wanted to do my own thing. Re read the, um, I read all of them too, man. All the fucking sheets that you'll see. Like on, I, like on the, like on these like sites and stuff that'll give you like information. I love reading that shit, but I just, no offense, man. I just didn't want a tour. You know, I really didn't. I, I, you know, and props to the guy for doing his job. And, but I was like, you know, there was just some miscommunication there. I wasn't told I was forced, um, to do that. So I'm sure it's probably more for like a security reasoning. Uh, and which is completely fair. It's just, that wasn't explained either. It was literally like, I was literally like, yeah, you have to be in this tour. You can't be in here. I was like, well, I guess like if I want to, if I want to get my money's worth, I obviously have to go in. Um, you know, Jesus. And, uh, no, I actually thought about like writing them up like the George's Island and just be like, Hey, like just give some feedback and just be like, Hey, listen, like, you know, I just kind of wish that was mentioned, you know, like I walked in and I didn't want to do the tour. I just wanted to go in and look and take some photos of my own, like, and do my own thing. Like I, I could just not have to just, you know, I don't want to be like next to them the whole time. I want to just do my own thing. I'll follow them, but like, I'm not going to, you know what I mean? I don't want to just like have to stand there in a room and just not be able to move forward or, or do whatever. Eh, and, and that's just me, right? That's just, uh, that's just a gripe on my own. So no biggie. But uh, overall, like I said, I enjoyed the island. Um, $25. It's okay. Yeah, the price was okay. Um, and it's, it's transportation there and back. So I guess that's fine. Um, would I do it again? Nah, probably not. Like maybe if I had a date, like maybe, and that's pushing it. Um, but yeah, there's a slim chance that I would do it again. Um, it was fine and I enjoyed it. Um, I really did. You know, I was, <laughs> I know it's kind of funny to say it like for the review, but like, I'm pretty sure I was like the only person by myself on the island. Like everybody there is like a family, a couple or a big group of friends. And then I like, when you get on the boat, um, like there's all kinds of tables and chairs everywhere. So of course everybody would all be like pulling out tables and they'd all be sitting together. And then there was like, there was like four chairs in the corner. And then I just went and sat there. <laughs> like they weren't even at a table. Like they were just like extra chairs kind of thing. And I just like sat in the corner by myself. I was like, ah, eh, that just seems fitting. But uh, yeah, I don't know. Overall pretty good that the boat's quick. Like it takes like less, I think it's like 10 minutes or less to get over to the island. Um, which is meant that like, you can't complain. So I don't know, man. Good time. Good time overall. George's Island. Um, yeah, finally glad I did it. Like that, it, like the, like the tour is like itself, like sells out like nothing. Right. So to kind of get on the tour, but like itself is like, it's like a fucking achievement in its own. Um, so I don't know if you guys ever get around to it, man, check it out. George's Island. It was a good time. Um, like I said, I, I would recommend people to do it. Um, I wouldn't necessarily go do it myself again. But uh, I would definitely recommend to go do it. Get it off the list. And, you know, and it is a good little trip. And it's fun. And they got some nice views. And there's, like, some seating areas. You want to go have, like, a little picnic. That would probably also make the tour a little bit better, too. Um, you know, to sit down with some friends and family. And, you know, have a little little snack. Maybe a little pulled pork or something. But, uh, you know, I didn't have that luxury. So, all right. 
Anyway, we'll take it easy, guys. Thanks for watching. This is uh, apparently my second vlog, so fucking more to come. All right.